So thanks a lot for checking in, checking out all those bass videos and this particular combination, which is a precision bass with chrome strings. Like I said, I wanted to try that out and I really liked it. I was surprised that you can get some slap bass sounds out of it, which is kind of interesting, which you wouldn't expect. Slapping on the precision, it's a very thick bass and on those thick uh, flat wound strings, but they're chrome, so they have a little bit more highs in them and it even works with overtones. I tried that a little bit. So it gives you a very um, balanced sound that's not completely in your face, but I think it fits very well in the mix. I liked playing on it. I had a little bit of a hard time adjusting to chrome strings in the first week or so uh, because they have, they're a little bit sticky. Um, my hands don't sweat much or anything, so uh, compared to, uh, let's say, Fender 9050 flat wound strings, um, they have a little bit more resistance. Uh, you almost stick to them a little bit, but that's only in the beginning. After you break them in, that's gone, and then and then you have a, a nice a nice you know you can smoothly play them. All right, so this is an American standard precision bass with a graphite truss rod. You know which makes it keep in tune a, a lot better than than you know regular truss rod. And uh, we have some Diodario. Uh, chrome strings on them and yeah worked well just showing you a couple more close-up pictures of the bass right here all right and so as to make it a fair comparison let's just jam over the same blues and funk tune with it before uh, on when we tested the few jazz basses and the same bass also with uh, nickel wound strings so you can get a, an accurate uh, feel for it <laughs> this little bit by turning down the tone control. Mm -hmm. 
Alright, that's about it. Thanks so much for watching and listening. Please make sure to like it, to subscribe, and to comment. I'd really like to hear what you're thinking and what your results are, what you're doing, what you're using, what you feel like. Um, it's very personal. So yeah, until next time, take care. Bye.